Hello, Geminis, and welcome to Believe You. I'm going to go ahead and do your 2024 reading, and let's see what messages God has for you guys. To get started, I'm going to start with the Butterfly Oracle cards for the life changes. And I just used this deck on another reading, so I'm going to go ahead and shuffle it good before I get started. Oh yeah, as I'm shuffling, I'll let you guys know um, for February, I'm going to do the love readings. Um, and then for March, I'm going to do some money readings for everyone for all the zodiac signs, okay? Alright, now let's get started. God, what messages do you have? I'm hearing no. i got to shuffle this some more. One more. I don't hear two more. Alright, this one. And two. I don't know why I'm hearing self-care for some of you guys. I'm also hearing um, relationships. You need to work on your relationships. Um, for some of you guys, working on a relationship with yourself. I'm also hearing my finance. All right, God, what messages do you have for the Gemini Collective? Let's see. For the changes that are coming in this year or changes that they need to make this year. Any more cards for them? All right, thank you. Well, let's do it. All right, we have windfall. Ooh, so you guys have some money coming in. This could be because of a career change. Um, I'm also hearing this could be because of like something you're doing at your job, like a raise, something like that. Also, some of you guys are working towards doing something individually, um, like a personal business, working from home, something different. But it's really gonna bring in some money for you guys. I'm also hearing for some of y'all doing the lottery and winning. <laughs> Hey, congrats if you do. And then we have religion and spirituality. Um, with this, I'm hearing that you're getting more in tune. I'm hearing with your, your star player. And there's a reader who says that. Uh, who is that? Oh my gosh. I wish I could remember who it is right now. Because I watch a few readers. But if they're coming to mind for a reason. Like, uh, I need to recommend you to watch them. Oh, I know exactly who it is. Um, is that the House of Oshun? I think so. I think it is her. Yes. Okay. Take a look at her readings. Because that popped up for a reason. Okay. She popped up for a reason. So definitely check out her Gemini reading if she has it. That's going to be very important for you guys. Alright. Anyways, next one. We have a new exercise program here. So with this... Definitely taking better care of your body, better care of your health. Um, your exercise is going to be very important. I'm hearing to tone up your body if that's what you're trying to do. For some of you guys, it's also part of your weight loss journey that you've been working on for a few years now. Um, which is okay. It takes time, right? It definitely does because I've been there, did that. <laughs> you know, and I got to get back on my journey soon enough. Anyways, <laughs> we have healing from the past here. So some of you guys, I'm hearing this is about forgiveness. Forgiveness for yourself, forgiveness for others, um, you know, depending on what it is, the situation. But also for some of you guys, I'm hearing just like this could be past childhood trauma that you still haven't worked through, you still haven't gotten over. Some of you guys, this could also be heartbreak um, that's been kind of blocking you from moving forward into new relationships or new things. Wow, that's literally crazy. I literally just said some of you guys' forgiveness. You know, need I say more? Um, <laughs> definitely needing to forgive once again. I mean, we have family changes here, so this could be some type of family change I'm hearing for some of you guys. Maybe a child coming into your life, maybe a new baby. Some of you guys, this could be like you know, working on things with your family, having a better connection with your family. Um, once you forgive them, I'm hearing like maybe communicating more with your family as you move forward. Everyone's going to have different situations, so whatever resonates with you or what you feel um, what you're called or compelled compelled to do. All right, next we're going to use the Chakra Wisdom Oracle cards. All right, let me shuffle this a few times. We have acceptance and mysticism. Ooh. Hey, there's going to be a surprise, surprise gift for some of you guys. Yeah, look at that, the joy and the acceptance. And that could be that windfall. For some, <laughs> for others, this could be like that miracle baby I'm hearing. 
some of you guys as well. It could be an opportunity that's coming in for you. Um, that you just don't see coming. So that's awesome. Wow, look at that. Isolation and miracle, yeah. This is definitely something that's going to be just for you. And I just noticed that this lovely whoop, black obsidian had turned. And that's about protection. That's the protection stone there. Oof. We have miracle and discovery. So maybe you're going to also learn something about yourself. You're going to discover something new about yourself. We're hearing a power that you possess within. God, what other messages do you have for the Gemini Collective? Beautiful. Thank you. Oop. And thank you for the messages that have come through thus far for them. We have guilt. Ooh. Okay, so there could be some guilt here from someone or from yourself. And that's where that forgiveness is needing to be made. Okay? Or come from, I'm hearing. Um, we also have perseverance here. So there's something I'm hearing that you're going through maybe presently when it comes to your healing. And that can be hard to do. Um, to heal, but you need to continue to push yourself forward. Know that you're being guided here by your spirit guides, by your ancestors. They are with you, and they are helping you through this, this path on your journey. We also have, again, acceptance popping out again. Yeah, accept this gift that is coming. Some of you guys, this is definitely a new job, because you see she's in her work uniform, you know, and she's working, and she's still being supported here. Yeah, so definitely keep that in mind. You also will have some support I'm hearing at, at your job or in a new career. And this could be even support that you're not seeing from people that you don't even know are supporting you. We have the faith card. Keeping faith as you move forward. Wow, that's literally funny. This song is called Sweet Acceptance. That just popped up. <laughs> um, but anyways, you know, keeping the faith as you move forward as well because things are going to get better for you. Wow. Mm -hmm. And as you keep that faith, keep that gratitude as well. That's going to be very important because that's going to bring you more blessings for you, you know? Mm -hmm. As we say, more blessings, the abundance. Again, the windfall. You have the abundance here that is coming in. Mm -hmm. And you see, he's so worried. So he's not getting no abundance. He's just thinking about it. And you see this girl, she's not thinking about it. She's just kind of chilling, even though her house is for sale and all that, right? She's just kind of going with the flow, and the abundance is coming to her. So I'm hearing, enjoy the journey. Have gratitude. Focus on the positive in your life, even if there are some certain situations that you're going through. That can be hard. That's why you have to persevere through that and continue to have that faith. We have the confusion here. Some of you guys get confused about... I'm hearing about, like, how to move forward, how to heal, but I'm, I'm hearing, like, in time, it'll happen, you know, just take your time with it, you have dissipating, yeah, some of you guys are feeling, like, stuck, feeling like you're old and aging, <laughs> but, like, you're not, like, I'm hearing, you. I don't know why I'm hearing you, you can teach an old dog new tricks, <laughs> for some of you guys, right, underneath all of it is the instincts of us. So to look at that, definitely follow your instincts as you move forward. That's going to be, I'm hearing, a guiding factor for you um, when it comes to those spirit guides and ancestors um, that are really trying to help you on your journey. 